the season for decorating the house and taking a trip, but the stress of it all can be overwhelming to your body. Christy Alavati with Aquatic Physical Therapy and Beyond has some tips to keep us at tip-top shape. So what types of injuries do you see this time of year? We see so many different types of injuries, and I think it's always what people least expect mm -hmm. because they're just caught up in the hustle and bustle of the season. They're excited to see family. They're doing whatever it takes to make everything super special. Yeah. And, you know, it might be something as simple as hauling that Christmas tree. <laughs> Right, they're and heavy. They are heavy. Or setting them up, they're all very awkward movements. Um, decorating the house, you know, getting every last Christmas light on the house. Mm -hmm. Once you've climbed that ladder about 40 or 50 <laughs> times and you haven't done that all year long, I think your knees are hurting, your back's hurting, and it just it's wear and tear on the body that it's just not used to. Right. And let's talk about the trip. No matter how you get there, whether you're flying, driving, train, you can risk an in injury. You definitely can, you know, especially for the older population. Or, or anybody that's prone to injury or stiffness in their joints, that that long airport layover or that long trip that they just want to hurry to get there and they stay in the car for five and six hours, it's really tough on the body and it causes a lot of stiffness. And then once you get there, if you're sleeping on the pull-out couch oh, or the yeah. air mattress <laughs> or just playing with the grandchildren, that is such a huge thing. And I see so many people that just want to prepare for seeing that grandchild. But you have to remember, if carrying groceries can be taxing for you, carrying a 40-pound toddler through the mall to see Santa Claus is probably going to hurt your back. Yeah. And might take, some, take months of therapy to recover. Right. So <laughs> is there anything you can do before you dive in? I think there's a couple things. I think, first of all, you know, it's important to know your limitations. You know, again, if you know certain activities, prolonged standing is troublesome for you. That wait for Santa Claus is probably going to be a little irritating. Um, I think with trips, you really have to factor in that time for stretching and you know, just getting out and moving around. But I think most important, I think it's important to take care of yourself and keep your body strong year round. Right. I think you can't ignore that ache or pain. I think, you know, you need to seek therapy, physical therapy, whenever you're having that pain that won't go away, when you're having additional stiffness. And then it's really important to carry on with what your physical therapist has prescribed to you to keep you strong. And there's no better place than to get started in the pool. Right. At our facility, we've got a state-of-the-art aquatic facility. We've got a pool where our knowledgeable physical therapists can watch every move you make. And it really helps people regain their strength, their flexibility, improve their balance, and really prepare their bodies for the holidays. This is such important information to think about this time of year. <laughs> Thank you so much, Christy. Thank you so much. You can get in touch with Aquatic Physical Therapy at 919-870-4444 or aquaticpt.net.